Okay, today's post, uh, as many of you know, I do a coaching program uh, and have for quite some time here. But uh, my students often ask me, and uh, recently, just this last week, another student's asking me, you know, how do I make a WordPress page or a WordPress blog, uh, or excuse me, a WordPress uh, post, uh, no index, and sometimes, or how do I make it no follow? So there's various ways with HTML you can do different things. Uh, I'm going to show you the easiest way, and what I use typically is a plugin, uh, and it's called uh, Robots Meta. So as usual, we go in here and you add new under plugins, and then we come up here to your box here, and of course you can upload a you can upload a plugin here or search. If you have it on your hard drive, you're going to upload it. But on this particular one, we're just going to search for it. And here's what we're going to search for. Robots. And I've already chosen it before, but anyway, Robots Meta. If you'll just type that in, hit your search. And when you get to the uh, Install Plugins page here that comes up here with WordPress.org, uh, as of February of 2011, the very top one that shows up here is Robots Meta. And typically, of course, you would uh, click Install Now. This, uh, this particular video is not letting me install it because I already do have it installed uh, on this particular uh, WordPress site of mine. And so uh, it doesn't give me the option to install it now. But this is what you would click here, and normally it would be the, the little blue Install Now would be available here. So as of February of 2011, this is version 331. It's put out by a guy named Juiced DeVault. He's got a couple different things. It's a free plug-in. It's got a pretty high rating, four and, a, four and a little bit of five here. But it works out perfect because this lets you very easily on any of your uh, WordPress posts or your WordPress pages, uh, just instantly on each one, you can custom just click a button, and you can make it either in no follow or no index or a combination of those, anything. So I'll show you how that works here. Again, you would install it here, and then once you installed it, you would activate it. And uh, once you've activated it, let's just pull up a, a, a post. Let me pull up a recent post that I did here. Okay. Uh, here's just an easy one here, but here's a, a recent post. On an exercise ball and of course here's your post and uh, you do your post either in HTML or visual here but where you're going to see this show up this robots meta you're going to see number one up in here you're going to see this area here show up towards the top on this right sidebar uh, again I just leave these I don't mess with any of this here at all but where I do uh, let me pull this down here where I do use it and where you'll see it is you come down here and you'll see close to the post tags here towards the bottom right side of your sidebar. And then below that is where you're going to see Robots Meta show up once you activate this program or this uh, plugin. And so it's real, real easy. By default, it's going to allow uh, the search engines to index as well as a follow your post or your page. And whether you're doing a post or a page, you're going to see the same box down here. So by default, it lets you do both. Uh, if you don't want it to be indexed, uh, usually you're not going to want it to be followed either. So these are going to be the two you're normally going to set. By default, this one's set. If you don't want it to be indexed, you just click this, and that will uh, automatically make that page or that post, uh, whichever it is that you're doing here on your WordPress blog, this will no-index it. Now, if you want to still leave it to be a follow, you just want to no-index it, we'll click this one here, and it'll no-index it and still leave a follow. Or if you want it to still be indexed but no follow, you can choose this one. So there's a, a neat little deal. Again, this program does it all for you here, real, real easy. Uh, but by default, normally you're going to index and follow both, uh, or you're going to no index, no follow both. So depending on which one, make sure, of course, uh, once you make these changes, that uh, that you go to the bottom down here. And as always, uh, excuse me, in this case, on a post or a page, typically, you're going to come up here and you're going to hit the update. Uh, area here make sure you update this area here once you make that change down there okay and that's all you got to do uh, that's uh, again something people ask a lot and that's a real, real easy thing to do it's a free plug-in doesn't take up much uh, 
uh, bandwidth or anything on there. It's a nice little program, and it'll work again same way. Even if you uh, do a page, it has that same boxes basically down there. Okay, hope you enjoyed that one. That's a very, very common asked question, and uh, take care. See you later. Dr. Quadlander signing out for Internet Marketing Advanced Training.